So I'm assuming that Ichigo's trying to find... <laughs> Whoa, I cannot pronounce his name. Urio. I was trying to roll the R. <laughs> Look at his face. To hopefully uh, find uh, where Ichigo... I mean, not Ichigo, where Rukia is. He wants to go to the Soul Society. <laughs> I like how he's intrigued. Oh, he just told him to meet Urahara. He doesn't think that Rukia went back. So where the hell did she go? Oh, she's going to her brother to spare you life. Hey, where's the cat chick? Thing, person. At least show the cat. Where's the cat? That baby girl is sexy. <laughs> oh, she's trying to bargain. Dormammu. Come to bargain. Wait, 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 wait. You're mad that she's disobeying you? Yeah, you're like, you pretty much told her, hey, I'm gonna kill you. If you don't do what I. Okay, never mind. I, I, I understand this point now. <laughs> Bo, how did... Damn, Renji's like, dude, kill the human. What a dick. Wait, he found her? What are the odds? They really totally made Renji very unlikable. Even more than he already is. <laughs> so the Baku got dude's brother person's like, alright, go ahead. Kill that little grand hollow person thing. Whatever. So Ichigo's goes like, hey, if I do it, you free Rukia. Yee. People come to bargain today. <laughs> He's like, Rukia, you're going to train me, right? Yo, that's not part of the plan. <laughs> Can't have a teacher. She ain't your sensei. If you give her your powers back. That is... He's pulling a tire. That's probably not even that heavy. And then this baby girl doesn't even look like she's 80 pounds. Like, ooh, you really are moving some serious weights. So you are not Inuyasha. God, dude, I love this girl. <laughs> She's real funny. <laughs> That's cute. Wait, so this freaking Grand Hollow's been after Ichigo for since, since he was a kid? So that explains why his mom's dead, right? I completely forgot that, but... Again, out of all odds, why did it take so long for this Grand Hollow to come back and finish the job? Oh, see, now he thinks that maybe the hollow was probably that little girl that he saw. Durr, it was a trap! It sounds like this is personal, yeah. Well, then again, you made it personal. By saying it's personal. Dude, stop! Don't, don't, don't look at him like that, like, yo, have you ever heard, don't talk to strangers? This guy is talking nonsense. He looks like he's homeless. <laughs> what, I was about to say, what if she falls? Alright, montage. About to wrap up. It's like they were probably only training for one day anyway. Oh, here he is, about to go Ted Saiga. Bring out your inner Inuyasha! Yay! 
<laughs> he wants a high five. You don't know what a high five is, lady. <laughs> What? I like how he's like, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go kill this grand freaking hollow person thing. But hey, you Renji, you're gonna kill Rukia. And I like how Renji's like, hey, dude, I ain't gonna do that shit. She's talking about, is it valuable? A family's bond? You have one with your brother. She's talking about she has no parents. Maybe she is adopted. I mean, not that it really matters, but once you're adopted, you find a new family. Love is compounding, man. It's all natural. I like how Ichigo's like, dude, you got a friend in me. And fuck the code. <laughs> that was a good moment. I like that. She talked about her feelings. She's bears. <laughs> ah, Rukia! Best girl, I'm telling you. So they're about to go to their mom's grave. I don't know if good things or bad things will come from this. Oh, look, the sisters are seeing a weird little girl. Don't go to it, it's a trap. Oh, I am Groot! Oh my god, what the hell is it doing? Oh my dude. Special effects are horrible. Oh, and it's got your family! Again! Make it even more personal. Talking about making it hurts. You just stabbed your mama. Whoa, wicked mask. She just put him to sleep. Okay then. I like how these motherfuckers are like watching, having a blast. Like, ah, Ichigo lost a limb. <laughs> but look, now innocent people are getting attacked. Holy oh, shit, it's like bright. People can't even see it. I think it's a freaking tornado. <laughs> I like that, it looks wicked. It's pretty cool. <laughs> so he is legit fighting fruits. And I like how the schmucks can help. And they're not even doing anything. Right, they can't see them. They don't. I mean, see him. He, he don't got powers. At least. Urio can. Oh my god. Did we? Chad caught that, right? Oh my dude! Crazy. That would a freaking duck. So you can see all that. Wait, they can't see it, but they can sense it. Or at least they can hear it. Wait, wait. I don't get it. Do, do you see him or not? It was left ambiguous, Lee. She felt him too? Oh, can you imagine that breath? 
Ugh. Ooh, I'm digging the claws though. It's wicked. Oh, Urio! Finally, my guy! That I, I, I goo that fix your glasses like a freaking idiot. Damn nerd. Go ahead, go ahead. You know you want to! You, you, you do that! You know you want to do that thing! Son of a bitch. You should just get contacts, my guy. You don't have to do the freaking glasses thing, you know, whatever. Like, ball, I you? Dude threw a car at them. <laughs> what is it doing? This is not my final form, final form? So it just jumped into a city bus. Why is he acting like where did he go? It's a huge ass monster, you know where it is! Why are you so stupid, Ichigo? That's why you're dead! Oh, she's telling him shoot him in the forehead! Yeah, you better not miss. Got him in the eye. She said the forehead! Idiot. I look at him. Sneak attack! See? I get how sad it is. And he's like, yeah, I did this for me, mom. But you didn't do it! You, you didn't help! Shut up! I'm being sarcastic, by the way, just in case. Dude. <laughs> hey, I did it! Ooh, yay! <laughs> Excuse me! Well, that came out of fucking nowhere! I swear, I didn't even know that was gonna happen! You are a son of a bitch! Renji! You motherfucker! You can't be cured? Wow! The betrayal! Kill both of them? Ranji ain't gonna do shit! He's not gonna kill Rukia. You little bitch, man. You only sneak attack people. <laughs> Well, so now it's Ichigo versus Renji. After he freaking fought a hollow. Did he really try to stab Rukia? Ah, he says you're slow. Dude, this is epic. Kick his ass, my guy. And again, your sword's a lot bigger than his. Oh! That was pretty cool. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, you gotta love the freaking sword fights, though. It's pretty cool. Like, literally, this... This is making up for the movie. <laughs> this fight alone, right here. You, you watch two hours just to see this part. You, you, come on, it's a sword fight, not a knee fight! That's cheating. It's my turn? You're two dust years too early to be my rival? Alright, he's summoning his Bankai, whatever it's called. Sabimaru, he hit. Freaking, how can a sword even do that? It don't even make any sense. Sword is down at Jojo! Oh my god, that looks horrible. Animation place. I never really liked Renji's sword thing. Fucking like boomerang sword thing. What the? Freaking sword rat. What is it? What are you doing? 
silly! That sword's meant to be. You want to stab someone to death? Not swing them around. Oh my God. Defeats the purpose. Look at this schmuck. Oh my God, Joe, so sorry, don't Oh, you called him a boyfriend? Wait, you jelly, little bitch. He's not gonna kill Rukia. He would never dare. And look, he ain't dead. He just got secondary burns, but he's okay. <laughs> oh, I think I just found the thumbnail. <laughs> Oh. Now kick him in the face. And tell him you slept with Vrukia, that would hurt his feelings. <laughs> oh, he cut your sword! Well, we know how that's possible, but it just happened. <laughs> Better stay down, bitch. Benji, forgot them. Oh, now here comes freaking. <sighs> it's a back you can But you gonna fight him too? Not only did he fight Hollow, he, he fought your your protege, people's person. And now you want some too? That ain't fair. Oh, this is a, a dumb idea. We stopped him with a... Oh, it's two fingers. Oh, sorry not. You're slow. <laughs> oh, it's the first time they showed blood, I think. Dude. Fall back. You're not his level. <laughs> he still wants more? My dude, just throwing the white terror. What the hell is that? I'm like, did he just give him a haircut? Stabbed him in the hair, like kind of flinch. Like your sword's not even bloody though. You're stabbing him, and there's no blood. This some um, bitch won't stay down. <coughs> There's nothing you can do, my dude. Mother, mother. All you're doing is getting your ass kicked, my guy. You're not doing anything. You might as well just tell him, hey, just kill me for her life or something. Because that's what you're doing. But I guess that's the whole point of the movie, because he wanted to protect his mama. He, he, I guess he's never been able to protect anyone. And I guess not until now. To he able to protect I don't freaking know, man. Is that the point of the movie? Oh cut you in the chest. See? I bet that one hurt. Does he have to do these poses every single time? Like, hey, Thor, put it back. Oh, yeah, he's gonna take me that thing with that. No, put it back in the sheet. My guy. Why? Stop being that guy. Alright. Is it over yet? If he gets up one more fucking time. Oh, my guy. Just stop! Are you not dead yet? What do you mean, He's actually smiling. Here we go again. Uh, I sheathed my sword. I'm gonna slash you. I'm gonna sheathe it again. <laughs> You lowly human. How dare you grab my brother's cape? <laughs> Bitch. He's been getting stabbed for you. I'm closer and I'll destroy you. I, I understand that she's doing this to save him. Hey, at least he got some upskirt action, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Let me stop. I'm, just, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. It's her, her only way of 
stopping her brother from killing uh, the Ishigo. Look at that face. It's like, yo, you. I'm like bleeding. It hurts. <laughs> and now, she's trying to get her powers back. Yo, Ichigo's gotta feel like the biggest idiot. Dude. Just like that, man. As quickly as she came, she's like, deuces. I didn't even ask for this. Or maybe she did. I don't freaking know. It's all sentimental now. I don't know if I should feel sorry for Ichigo, but I really don't. Look at baby girl, look at her, yo, she is awesome, I love Rukia. That was my favorite character, a uh, bleach. I not, I do sis. She should be like, high five. <laughs> Fucked up. Damn, you know what? What I, I honestly feel sorry for him. Dude, look at his tears. Yeah, just sleep it off like it's just a freaking Sunday. Oh, my wounds are healed. So back in his freaking bedroom, like nothing happened. I thought the dad was gonna put him in a hammerlock again. Would have been hilarious. So they're talking about how there's a tenator in a tray station which is devastating. And again with his dumb joke about how Ichigo's dead. It's fucked up, man. How are you, like, randomly okay? Or maybe am I that stupid? It was his soul thing. I don't freaking remember. Whatever. He's fine, whatever, yay! Good for him. <laughs> That's a weird introduction. Mind you, this motherfucker got stabbed! And he's walking around like he's okay! The Quincy dude! How did he get better? Yeah. My dude, he's like, yo. Went from Rukia to, uh, what up, Orihime? <laughs> Make a scene and you're dead. Uh. Da. Alright, um. And that wraps up the movie. <laughs> I don't even know how to speak. Um. Honestly, the movie was okay. It, it wasn't mind blowing. It wasn't the greatest thing I've ever seen. It was, it was decent. It was okay. If I were to rate it from one star to five, it's a, it's a two star. It's a two star movie. It's not even average. It's just okay. Now, of course, if you're some Bleach fan, Natic, if you love the anime, if you love the manga, I'm sure you're gonna love the movie way, way more than I will. Now, personally, of course, my take on the Bleach anime, I find it dull, I find it, I found it to drag a little bit too much, and I almost see the same scenario happening in this movie, too. It, it was two hours long, and there was times where you're like, get to it, just move on, get to the point. And then there's some times where you're like, hey, have some character development, and nothing. We got nothing. So, all right, in today's second half of the movie, uh, pretty much... Uh, Rukia, uh, was gonna give herself up to her brother, Byakuga, whatever, and Renji. Uh, but then Ichigo showed up in the nick of time, and he's like, look, how about I take down this weird, hollow, fisher person, and then, you know, hey, you, you leave Rukia alone. And then, he actually does that. Ichigo stops the hollow, but not necessarily by himself, because obviously, uh, Rukia ended up training him to get better. As a Soul Reaper, and Urio helped him, the Quincy, you know, he helped him with some bow shots here and there, and uh, Ichigo was able to hit the final blow on the Hollow. After that big fight, he had to fight Renji, he kicked his ass, and then after that fight, Bakuga, freaking, I don't know, 
showed up too when he beat the shit out of freaking Ichigo. And after what felt like 20 minutes of freaking Baku got, you know, freaking stabbing Ichigo, uh, Rukia, uh, jumped in and she's like, I hate you, Ichigo. You're, you're nothing but a human. Go away. And she took her powers back and she left, uh, with her brother. Now, of course, I'm, you know, remembering the show and whatnot, or even how the context of the movie, that, uh, Rukia only did that, of course, to keep Ichigo alive. You know, she's just like, hey, like, if I just tell, if I just convince my brother that I hate this guy, uh, then maybe he will just freaking let him live, and pretty much that's what happened. Now, as far as the movie as a whole, you know, it was enjoyable, but it was extremely long, um... Would have loved to have more character development uh, for a lot of the other characters. Some of them were just there. Um, that's one thing that hurts anime movies, is that you're just trying to adapt it. You're not really giving a narrative. You're just going, oh yeah, these things happen in the manga or the, an anime, so let's have these things happen in the movie. And you're like, wait, uh, you, you need context. You need credibility. You need to be able to like these characters uh, especially when you don't know them, uh, that's why these movies suck, because you don't develop the characters enough, and then you have them do uh, crazy scenarios, situations, that, yeah, are action-packed and beautiful to see, but there's just no umph uh, to liking what's happening, and you're like, eh, whatever, it just happened, you know, and that, that's how I look at it, that's why I just, I, I just wasn't attached to these characters, except for my bias of Rukia. I'm telling you, I don't know why. I freaking love the hell out of that character. I freaking love me some Rukia. Now, what does that mean for the future of Bleach, uh, as far as, like, live-action movies go? Uh, I don't know how they dictate, uh, like, sequels here. I don't know if it's because uh, of critical acclaim or how much uh, the fans or I don't know how much money this movie could possibly make through Netflix. Um, like, will they ever make a sequel? I, I would definitely, definitely, uh, would enjoy a sequel. Um, my only concern would be is an anime like this where it's freaking 300, 400 episodes deep. I don't want to see 10 movies, you know, or 10 live action movies. Would have been great to have the story condensed, but it's just, it's impossible when you have such a narrative like, like this type of animes. But, I would definitely love a sequel. Heck, I would just enjoy a live-action television show of Bleach. Like, if, if they decided not to make a movie and decided to make the sequel into, like, an actual show, that would be freaking awesome, too. Now, if Netflix is going to go on this continue onslaught of doing live-action animes, can, you know, can, like, I pick the next one? <laughs> Inuyasha! Do Inuyasha, now that you did swords and stuff, Inuyasha, please, live action Inuyasha, come on, hashtag Netflix, Inuyasha, let's get Inuyasha, please, I beg you, <laughs> sorry guys, uh, that about wraps up uh, my video, what are your thoughts on Bleach, what did you think of it, because I love to know. Did you like it? Did you hate it? What do you think of the special effects? What do you think of the acting, the characters, the actual art, the actual movie itself? So make sure you discuss with me and others by leaving me any positive or negative feedback down in that comment section. Feel free to like this video or subscribe to my channel if you haven't before. And as always, God bless you, and I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.